hello welcome back to my channel today i'll be showing you how i'm taking off my gel acrylic nails i've had them for a month now before i go on i just want to give a big shout out to my girl raruso for getting me this variable speed rotary detail cover because i'll be using it today to file down my nail I haven't used this before so here's a mini story of how you can set this up the next thing you want to do is to insert it into the hole there right there it's pretty easy straightforward screw the the cover on the tool and once it's properly screwed then you can attach the mouth of the usb cord into a laptop or any other device and your virtual cover is on so it only has two buttons on or off you can't regulate it more than that but it works perfectly well serves the purpose and i love the fact that it comes with the usb as well So I filed them down as much as I could. So I cut my artificial nails according to the length of my natural nails because I wanted to maintain them. Guys, if you want to take out your nails at home as a DIY project, you have to purchase 100% acetone. Nail polish remover would not cut it. Just add the acetone into the ziplock bag and dip my hands into it if you have a bowl at home use a bowl that will save you a lot of trouble i had to stop using the ziplock bag at some point because it was peeling i just couldn't keep my hands in it and i was also impatient Hear me out. This actually works. Acetone helps dissolve the nail polish. However, it takes forever, and if you're impatient like me, you're going to be dipping your, you're going to be taking your hand out of the bowl every five minutes, 
and then you're going to be battling with tearing the nail polish out of your fingers and you don't want that so just go to the salon i kept doing this back and forth until finally i got the nail polish out to a manageable level but yeah if you have no option fine do it yourself but it wasn't an experience i would like to repeat There's always that moment when you want to give up, but then it feels like it's too late to give up. This was that. Once the acetone had finished getting my nail polish off, I washed my hand with water and soap, hot water to be specific and then I oiled it up a bit because acetone really made it dry and I was just not comfortable with that. Thank you guys for watching, for staying up to this time. Kindly like, comment, subscribe. Until next time.